Hi everyone and welcome to another episode of Stardew Valley. I am Hisame, your host. Um, so since the last video I um, had a friend come by and marry um, Elliot who I divorced. So I will show you how the NPC uh, behaves in that situation. Um, so here uh, I finally had time to retexture the furniture and this is how it looks so far. Okay, got mail. Oh, she gave me a pizza, battery from Pam. Okay, so he wants a melon, potato. Emily, I haven't checked my mail in a while uh, since we played. Me, okay, red pepper. I got a lot of stuff to uh, uh, give. Okay, so this is my fish chest. Um, not sure where I'm gonna put everything. Best not to keep items from mods in your inventory, it can get bugged and you can have issues. So the rest is uh, pretty much vanilla. I will just dump whatever is extra here. I don't know. Um, probably gonna need that. <laughs> Do be careful when you throw stuff out. Uh, you can take out the last item you've thrown in the trash. So for example, I throw this and then the battery, I can only get the battery back. So that's it. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys updates on my farm in this video. This is how the retexture furniture looks. I still got an empty cabin. Uh, one more room for someone. Um, so this is how it looks when they're all grown. Uh, this is my friend Maddie's cabin. Uh, she's married to Elliot who absolutely hates me now. But he will still be on the farm sometimes, not today. Hmm. Not very good for a presentation. Oh, there he is. I was wondering. Okay, so he doesn't want to talk to me. He hates me. But he'll still be on the farm here. Okay. Uh, so I did a little uh, resting area here. I uh, take a bath, sit around, have a enjoy the weather. Here I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I have to fit the slime hutch somewhere as well. Maybe I'll do a temporary slime hutch there. Uh, here are the animals. Uh, since it's a forest themed farm, all the animals are uh, forest uh, animals. Uh, so here is the pig. I turned him into a bear, doves, uh, wild geese, crow, and you have a little path here which I always forgot about. Uh, Maddie reminded me that you can. Uh, and I've retextured the, the sheep as a fox, so I guess you can take the wool off of a fox. Um, so you can place tiles on the floor here, just so you know. You can do a path. Uh, I've retextured, if you remember, the um, um, stone sign as a little platform that you can put stuff on. Uh, you can also put tools here, like I put the milk pail. So it seems like uh, I'm milking the cows and I put the pail there. It's actually in here. And I do have the husbandry mod, that's why I have uh, beef and uh, the syringe for insemination. So the melon finally grew, I'm super happy about that. Uh, I don't think it had to do anything with this one because it took forever and um, the configuration either is broken and it remains the default 5% or it's just not working at all because it took like two weeks for them to fuse into this one. It was such a pain to get the melon on my other map. I wasn't even able to get a giant melon anymore. Uh, so this is my sister's um, cabin. 
Uh, okay, you're kind of sad today. Okay, you're confusing me with your spouse. So this is some of the furniture. It's uh, Yellogs um, furniture. I'm not sure exactly of the name. But if you search for Yellog, you'll find it. Okay, I wanted a mushroom over there. And it says mushroom, and like it said yesterday, but you might get something else. You never know. <laughs> there are some little issues when you use mods, sometimes things get confused. Okay, so I think I showed you everything on the, the farm. Uh, I'm gonna go and now show you guys uh, the racetrack and let's see if we'll uh, um, if I'll have time to do any secrets. I don't want to do the video too long, but let's see. Gotta put some roads here so I can see where I'm going. <laughs> so what I've done here is kind of make a makeshift uh, racetrack um, type of uh, space for events. Um, I also retextured some of the uh, artifacts. So this is the rusty spoon. I made it into a non-rusty spoon. Um, a fork, knife, glasses, a plate. <laughs> I've retextured them so uh, they look like uh, dinnerware. So I have put some uh, tuna and beef there for the um, uh, grills. They're not from the, they're just retextured bonfire, but I do want to see if I can get uh, the redux farming machines uh, to work again. Gotta check which versions with which support mods they will work with uh, because you do have a working grill there and a lemonade machine and a bunch of other fun stuff. There I'm gonna do kind of a beach area setting like I did on my farm and let me show you how the racetrack looks. So when I get all of the free friends to come and visit uh, we can have like a little race here um, this is not the definitive racetrack but I think we will stay this way I don't know I have to see what everybody else thinks I like this one it has a bit of a trick there with the stone so you gotta be careful um, and then you end here, but I think maybe it would make more sense if uh, you if you go in a loop like this to go from where you started, or make it maybe make it more than one lap, have it like two laps or three laps. I'm not sure. Okay, um, so I've shown you that. Uh, I'm gonna show you a secret. So, where you can get some of the secret statues. I should have written it, uh, written them down before I started this video because now I realize that some of them I don't remember. So, you have a bunch of uh, chests here that are hidden. So, for example, this one, there you have a wooden chest there. Uh, and if you put a purple cucumber, it should give you a statue, which I have retextured as a chair in my craftables. And as you can see, I have some pixels from a sh the shading of an object from above, so I didn't uh, retexture it very well. I have to go back and fix that. Um. Another one is uh, in Vincent's room. 
And you got about three of those uh, peculiar statues, I think. Hi there, Leia. I think it's Leia. Since the um, seasonal outfit mod, I kind of sometimes get them confused. Because you have like three characters with red hair. <laughs> Yay! Ah, I should have had my music not turned off. Sorry about that. Can I? No. So if you have your music turned off, you're not going to be able to hear it anymore, which is pretty sad. Um, Noise Rock? They changed the name, it used to be Alternative something, I'm pretty sure. Experimental Noise Rock. No, I want rock, but I don't want that. Uh, I don't even know what this is. I guess dancing is good. So you will get a follow-up cutscene on this one where they go and... Oh, his head is going through the keyboard. <laughs> uh, where they go and sing at a concert. So uh, depending on your choice here, they'll play one uh, type of song or another. Uh, I'll put some music on, hopefully it will not be too loud. Um, next time I get another scene. And you gotta put a strange bun here. Um, strange bun... Uh, I don't actually have the recipe, but you can get it as a monster loot. Uh, it drops. Strange bun, this is it. And you can also get it in the mail from some of the characters, I'm not sure. Yay, and I have it retextured as a piggy statue. I'm curious if you can ever buy the strange bun from uh, the saloon. I think you might be able to. I'm just gonna drop in. Not today. But I'm pretty sure I saw it here at some point. Okay, so I think that was it for today. Uh, tomorrow's gonna be the 28th, the last day, and I'm gonna show you another secret where you can get the Junimo plush toy as well as um, um, the Luau event. Uh, sorry, the jellyfish uh, event. And I think that will be pretty much it. I'm gonna go to Maru, see if I can trigger one of the uh, hard events if I visit her. Hello, Abigail. One of my favorite cutscenes in the show is... Uh, in, sorry, in, <laughs> in the game is... Uh, um, Abigail singing in the rain. Hmm, where is Maru? So, let's see, where could she be? She's not there, she's not at home. Hmm. She might be hiding in the basement working, uh, that's one of the bizarre parts, so you cannot go in. Which I'm pretty disappointed because I have quite a lot of hearts with her, but there are only certain times when the event triggers. If you go out here, oh, you're just gonna go outside. So yeah, that was it. So thank you for watching guys, hope you've enjoyed it. And uh, if you have any more questions or suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye everyone. Oh, there she is. Maru, 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 show me a cutscene. Come on. Okay. 
Oh, she's looking at the stars. Maybe if I go out and go in, I'll see that cutscene. Nope. No cutscene. Huh, <laughs> now it's locked and I can't go in. And... So she has a really nice uh, cutscene where she looks at the, um, the stars. And I get it now. Yep, yes! Oh, it's another one. <laughs> Good enough. Uh, I really do like uh, Linus. Will you teach me the secrets of the wood? Oh, it's okay. <laughs> that doesn't sound right. I don't know if you can hear that, but it's super creepy. Yay, got the recipe! Learn craft wild bait. That's a really good bait. And I need to correct my dress. <laughs> Let's see, can I get the cutscene with Maru? No. He just doesn't want to show me the telescope. Maybe it has to be like a later time. Yep, finally got it. So it seems you need to be over 10 o'clock to get this uh, cutscene. And I super really like this cutscene. So nice. Usually you don't see uh, the sky in Stardew Valley. Uh, I used to have the Summit um, expansion space, but I guess they took it out and never put it back in. It's actually harder to look for a telescope than I thought. A friend of ours has a telescope and I could only see like this blurry little thing and it was going super fast. Um, I thought it was a comet but um, I was told no, it was Saturn. It was really far away and hard to see, apparently. Also I have glasses so I can't put my eye directly on the telescope thing. So it was really hard to see anything. But there we go, we have a little planet there. I mean, it's beautiful. Most beautiful pixels you've ever seen. <laughs> oh. Maru is my favorite character. It's like the first character I um, married in this game and I played her on many farms but uh, since I started doing videos I tried other characters as well so that I can show you guys the cutscenes so that was it thank you everyone for watching and see you in the next video bye bye